here's a quick hit on the 158 trick, as I call it. I'm sure there's lots of other names for it. Um, other people have. Everybody does it. What's the name? What's it called? The 158 trick. Take uh, the key of C. And in the right hand, we're going to improvise a line. How about that? Nope, just, just. How about that? Now, let's see if I can remember that lick. Uh, in my right hand, I'm going to play one, five, and eight. Diatonically, diatonically meaning in in the key that I'm playing in. In this case, C. So I'm gonna I'm gonna play one five eight from each scale degree. So the lick goes three, but I'm gonna scoop it from the minor third, right? Three, five, six, minor third to the two, to the one, six, one. Okay. Which is the basis of a lot of great. Back to the basic. Scoop the three, five, six, minor third to the two. I call it scooping. Call it whatever you want to call it. One, six, one. In the right hand, we're going to play octaves. Here's the first part. First step to this trick. Let's play octaves. What's the next thing we're gonna do? So the, call that one eight. All octaves, right? One eight, one eight from the third degree, or one eight from the minor third to the three. Still one eight, right? One eight from five, one eight from six, and so on. Now, put the fifth in the middle of each one of those diatonically. What does that diatonically mean? In this case, it's C. It's all white keys, with the exception of this. When we go to the minor third, we're going to put the B flat on top, in the middle. So here's the configuration. One, five, eight. All diatonically, all in the key of C, in this case, white keys. Right? Except for the minor third, we're going to use the 1, 5, 8 of the E flat is 1, E flat, 5, B flat, and then 1, 1, 5, 8. I do this all the time in uh, blues. There's our lick right there. Lyle Mays does this all the time. My beloved man crush, Lyle Mays, God rest his soul. But do this st stuff. Take a, uh, I, I'm going to divert for a second. Take a, you know, my favorite, one of my favorite chords. F minor 11. It's a nice little lick, right? Whoops. If I can play it right. Here's my F minor, one, minor third, minor seven. Put a nine on. And eleven. One, three, minor seven, nine, eleven. Got it? What was my line? Starts on the fourth degree, goes down to the minor three, goes down to the third, uh, nine, sorry. Then to the five, to, to seven, all in F. In F, B flat is the four. In F minor, A flat is the third, minor third. In F minor 11, G is the nine. Scoop it. Five. In F minor is a C. Seven, minor seven. In F minor is an E flat. So now I'm going to go do it. Remember, step one, octave. One. And eight, make it make it octaves. That's pretty, right? Put the one five eight in that line, which is 
Yes, D natural. One five eight trick starts here. Bah. And then it goes. Then goes. So in the key of F minor, if I'm just gonna improvise, uh, put a, a raise six in it. I'm going to go Dorian. In other words, this F minor, F minor 11, is the two chord in E flat. Five, 13 flat 9, flat 2, E major 7, sharp 11, and then back to my 1 chord. F minor 11, typical Lyle line, and it's still friggin' beautiful just because it is, never gets old. use octaves all the time. So octave, there's our lick. Let's one five eight trick it. Oops. All diatonic, remember four flats except for the D natural. One five eight, okay? In, in the key of C7, I did was play this and then I put octaves on it and then I one did a one five I put the fifth in the in between the one and the eight 